70% of Lubbock Power and Light customers are already on the ERCOT grid, but the highly anticipated transition to a competitive electric market cannot happen until every LPNL customer is plugged in together. Yeah, after a number of delays, that move is set to happen in less than a month, and only then is when we'll begin the process of choosing our own power providers. Gail Case Jack C. Pigeon explains how it'll work. We have to do this so we can get 100% across the line and we can move into the next phase of how folks are going to get their electricity here in Lubbock. Nearly two and a half years after the majority of Lubbock Power and Light customers made the big switch to the ERCOT grid, the remaining 30% will make that move on the weekend of December 9th. For months, our folks have been going through and doing very meticulous planning so that when you come to the weekend, hopefully you run through it efficiently enough that folks see very, very minimal impact. We were successful in doing that in 21 and that's what we're gonna look at doing again. 20,000 customers will be impacted compared to the 83,000 in 2021. Although smaller in volume, Rose says it's actually more work. This time it's a little bit different in that we're not needing to go substation by substation, but instead we're needing to connect distribution lines to other sets of lines. But from a customer standpoint, the impact and what they experience is almost the same. Just like in 2021, those affected will get a note in the mail notifying them of an expected 30 minute power outage during the transition. It's gonna cause a disruption on the customer's end. We understand that, but this is necessary work to get us to where we need to be. And once we complete this final transfer, this type of work will be done. It will be behind us. We don't have to worry about any type of these outages going forward. Rose says customers part of the final move are spread out across the city and not done by neighborhood or region. We're working very closely with Emergency Operations Center and with Lubbock Police Department to make sure as we go through this, we give enough information to customers so that they can plan, but we also stay safe and that we don't put them in a situation where folks know that they're out of power and can take advantage of that. There will be a tool available on LPNL's website soon, where you can enter your meter number off your bill for a more accurate day and time of when you'll lose power. Jaxie Pigeon, KLBK News.